Hello, my friends, and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. This video deals with two things. One, but they're related. Uh, the structure is that keeps them together is Japan uh, discharging some uh, treated radioactive water into the Pacific Ocean. Damn, yeah, it's treated. Uh, so one, I, oh, I'm gonna on this one. I'm gonna have two issues. One, how Japan and some weasels are defending that uh, discharge of treated radioactive water into the Pacific, saying that don't worry, no problem with that. That's the first one, and I will tell you. And the other one, you have friends and foes uh telling japan what the f are you doing and japan is like what well let me show you the what happened maybe you're not aware of it reuters reports that in china fukushima discharge met with bands you remember the fukushima the nuclear power plant disaster all right it discharged some we find down here treated radioactive water right here into the pacific ocean from the wrecked fukushima nuclear plant so these guys are you know release japan's release on thursday of treated radioactive water so when i talk about russia and this and that just think of this now the problem is i'm not gonna be dealing with uh china you know bans and panic and uh, they banned any buying any products from coming from japan from uh, you know, sea products and so on so that's not what my my goal here that's something else down here at the end right at the end this is why i picked this article actually for this last thing japan japan has criticized china for spreading and i'm quoting scientifically unfounded claims End quote and maintains the water release is safe remember keep in mind water is safe noting that the international atomic energy agency iaea has also concluded that the impact it would have on people and the environment was negligible so the impact that water would have on people is negligible and now i'm going to discuss the first issue and this is what you should do with people who want you to do something why don't you drink some of that water after you drink i don't know for about a year that uh nuclear or treated right treated water then which has a negligible impact on humans and environment then i'm okay with you to release it in nature after you drink it the whole year deal I will ask that person to do it for a month, for a week, for a glass. They will not do it. Why? <laughs> for obvious reasons. So this is the treated, uh, right? How is that? The treated radioactive water. Would you dare? Would you have the courage to drink it? I would not. I'm a coward. I would not drink that. I have to tell you. But I would bet that no one, no one who defends this discharge or release of water would drink a glass of that uh, treated. Just the name is crazy. Treated radioactive water. <laughs> All right. So again, it's negligible. If it's negligible, why don't you uh, being treated, just put it for, I don't know, uh if it's salty water turn it into drinking water which they can nowadays uh israel does it right so after that you give it to your population and your children your families and everything is okay and after you do this for a year then the, everybody's gonna move into japan because japan is gonna be empty of people <laughs> because they decided to drink the water so that's the first point the second one comes with the second article that i have here ready and uh, if you remember, Japan and South Korea right now, they're friends. Together with United States of America and sometimes Australia and New Zealand, they're friends against China's invasion of uh, the world. 
okay? And the little woodchuck crazy uh, nuclear weapon that he has them for offensive means. So here is the article. Remember, this is the opposition. Bloomberg, Fukushima release is a provocation. South Korea opposition says. Now you can say, well, it's uh, these guys are just uh, getting uh, you know the chance to say something. Yes or no? What do you think? Is a provocation? The leader of South Korea's biggest opposition party said Japan's release of treated water. No, 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 no. I like this one better. Treated radioactive water. I like that one better than treated water. Who, who's this? Bloomberg? <laughs> you see? So you already know who are they with. The release of treated water from the ruined Fukushima nuclear plant is an affront to humanity, even as his rival president, Yoon song yul supported it. Of course he supported it. Why not? So, my friends, these guys who are for illegal immigration, which is people crossing, entering a property, trespassing without the owner's uh, approval, that's trespassing, that's illegal, which is a person who enters your house without your permission is illegal. You can call the police or you can uh, send them out. All right. That's one. So all these guys who are for that, as I always say, get about five families of these poor migrants, undocumented, and bring them to their houses. Five family, I mean, uh, 10 adults and about uh, five multiplied by five, 25 children. So 25 children plus, plus, as I said, 10 adults. Okay, so you're going to have about 30, 35 uh, people in your house and you help. Then, then, and keep this for 10 years. You know why I say 10 years? Because any person who's a refugee here or comes here and um, is allowed to have a certain kind of, uh, how do you call it, uh, for 10 years, um, for instance, if you want to sponsor something, somebody, something, yeah, someone to come here and they allow you to sponsor that person for immigration, all that, you sign a document saying that for 10 years, 10 years, you agree to support that person if that person doesn't have a job, doesn't have a uh, housing, doesn't have anything. 10 years. So that's what you do. You, that's why they wanted to, you make sure that you're going to be liable for his for supporting that person. So that's him here. I will have him 10 years, these 35 people, as I said, five families, I will have them live with these guys, uh, liberals and uh, professor, the university professors and politicians. These are the ones that are untouched by these guys. On the contrary, some uh, groups are uh, actually doing better if these guys come over. I'm talking about some politicians, all right? And some businesses which are going to have very cheap labor. And we, we have to compete with them. All right. So if you're a, let's say, a pipe layer and you do it for $20 an hour, uh, and I bet a guy who just crosses the border would do it for $3 an hour. So what are you going to do? Sell your boat, your house, your family? What are you going to do? All right, my friend, we're just going to start drinking and what? So my friends, this is uh, Fukushima. Fukushima, okay? So Fukushima drink some water, uh, the guys who promote that that. Thing. What is the name? Treated nuclear, whatever. What was it that I like that? Treated radioactive water. It has a insignificant, insignificant, minuscule, minuscule, no impact. It, it doesn't even is significant. Nothing. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Stay strong, stay smart, look for the truth, and be just.